the bustling metropolis of Kolkata would have been a whole lot different if not for the substations department. One of the most important engineering departments in CESC, the substations department is directly responsible in taking electricity to the people. Tracing its origins back to the pre-independence India of 1911, the department is old, yet it is new in its outlook. And true to its organizational values of leading innovation and modernization in the power sector, the substations department keeps adopting new technologies in the field of electrical engineering. This brings us to the topic of the hour, the fourth industrial revolution and the resultant information age. The world today is connected in more ways than it ever was. Someone sitting in Kolkata can get real-time updates on the status of US presidential elections. So, why should the substations department lag behind? It has not. The substations department, with some help from the business intelligence and analytics cell, has initiated a remote monitoring system. Now, distribution transformers, power transformers, and unmanned substations can be monitored from remote locations. This, in effect, will reduce any delay in attending faults and maintaining reliability of customer service. This is how it is done. Through it, CESC personnel monitor multiple parameters from current in LV windings to pressure, humidity and temperature. This, for example, is Anandapur distribution substation. It is one of CESC's unmanned substations. Its functionality is monitored completely from a remote location at CESC's office. This is the first unmanned substation where in addition to the major equipment like power transformer and switch gear, we also digitally monitor the auxiliaries like water pump, ER lightings, etc. from our remote location. Soon, this state-of-the-art system will get implemented throughout most of the 8,500 plus distribution transformers installed throughout the entire 567 square kilometer of CESC's network area. Thus ushering in a brighter future for the city of joy.